My name is Chris. Um, I've just I've moved to LA recently, um, and it, it's weird because um, uh, where I come from, um, no one cares that I sound like this. <laughs> but I've moved here, and I've realised that you guys care um, too much, too much that I sound like this. It's quite creepy at times. I put my mouth on an American, and always goes, "Oh my God, your accent! It's so charming." so charming when you talk and I'm there going, really? What movies are you watching? Because every time I watch a movie and there's someone in it that sounds like me, it's never charming. It is the voice of pure evil. <laughs> it's never like, would you like a scone? It's always like, burn them, burn them all. <laughs> Steal their land and burn them all, sire. So either your accent's charming or the other one you guys love to chuck at me is, which part of Australia do I come from? I was like, clearly I don't come from Australia. Does it look like these jeans unzip and turn into shorts? No. These are British trousers, thank you very much. I never feel more British than when I'm driving my car in Los Angeles. I feel very British when I'm in my car here. Especially when the light goes yellow. Because like a chump, I'm there going, oh, it's probably time to slow down. <laughs> you guys are going, probably time to speed up, buddy. A yellow is basically a green if you narrow your eyes and you believe in yourself, so... I'm trying to get my hand in the American culture. I did actually go to my first basketball game before I'm going to immerse myself in the culture. Um, this is true. I don't remember anything from the game. The only thing I remember was at halftime, I was in the bathroom and I saw a man walk into a stall eating a pizza. And I thought, <laughs> and I thought this truly is the greatest country on earth. It really is. Where I'm from, we've got a phrase, don't shit where you eat. You guys are like, we shit while we eat. <laughs> this is Trump's America. We don't give a shit anymore. It's fine. <laughs>